Well, um, I just stayed, stayed with it, stayed aggressive. Um, you know, saw some cracks in the defense where I, I had opportunities to dive, and, and uh, you know, tonight I did a good job in not settling. And, uh, you know, when, I, when I'm able to do that for my team, it helps us out it's extremely well, especially when they uh, when they try to double team off me. I have to make my present myself as, as uh, in the middle of the court and just make plays out of the double teams. Josh, how good does this feel? I mean, I know you have to hear when fans get upset with you and they're booing you, especially at uh, at home. What does it What does it mean to come out and have a performance like this? And, and obviously, everybody was cheering for you at the end. Oh well, I can't. Uh, you know, when people don't understand the game and don't know the game, it really doesn't faze me. You know what I mean? When, when, when people are here, uh, night in, night out, cheering for the Atlanta Hawks, uh, minus the postseason, that, that's, that's, that's what matters to me. And my teammates matter extremely more than anybody else. And they believe in me. They have confidence in my game. And, uh, you know, when, when I was in my rut, they just stayed with me, told me to stay positive, stay in my game, do what, I, do what I've been doing all season long. And, uh, you know, I just stuck with it. And, uh and, you know, I had the game that I had tonight. Josh, you talked about you saw some cracks in the defense. Can you expand on that, you know, on the interior? You know, obviously you guys did a lot better, you know, scoring the ball inside tonight. I think we did a good job at presenting ourselves, too. Um, all that doesn't matter unless we show our hands and we show it. We, we were active in the middle of the court, and that's what we was able to do. Um, you know, Zaza, Al, and myself, we made uh, some good, good interior passes. Uh, we got some easy buckets, and uh, you know we was able to. Uh, they opened our game up a little bit more. As a team overall, what was the difference uh, tonight compared to Friday? Uh, our energy level and our effort. I think uh, as starters, we have to do the, we have to do our part and, and uh, start in tempo early. We got out there, we got off to a good start, and it, and it trickled down from the bench players that came in. Josh, in the fourth quarter especially, you started playing closer to the second half, you started playing closer to the basket and kind of abandoning the jump shot. Was that a conscious decision on your part? Was that something coach told you to do? Or? We got to win, and that's all that matters to me. I mean, uh, whether I dove or not, it's not about me. It's about this, about the win, and uh, that's what we're going to concentrate on. We're going to concentrate on winning. We know what we need to do in order to beat this team, and uh, we gotta go. We gotta go up there Tuesday, and we gotta be. We're gonna be in a dog fight. Josh, you um over here, buddy. You um spent a, a good amount of time at the at the three uh, for the game, and that's where you have a pretty you know sizable um, advantage, both you know physically and athletically. Um, what? How does how does that affect your game and help your game? Uh, just trying to do the do the things uh, at the three um, that Dang does. He's a good, he's a great slasher, plays well off the ball, and um, you know I wanted to be able to try to do the same thing for my ball club. I was able to be effective doing that and uh, crashing the boards as well. So um, you know when I'm at the three, I, I kind of like I, I kind I'm kind of like Dang in a sense uh, with, with him slashing and and, uh, and being able to uh, get to the hole. Jones, did you feel like this was a game that you you sort of had to put on your shoulders? I understand that. You know, you felt a little, I don't want to say guilty is not the right word, but a lot of blame went your way after game three. Did you feel like you needed to respond to that? Well, uh, the media is trying to T.O. me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I say. So, I mean, if y'all want to blame it all on me for, for losing game three, <laughs> it's cool. I'll take it. I'm a man. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a, you know, we got a quote in there in the locker room. It says, tough times never last, but tough people do. And I consider myself a tough person. And uh, I knew that this world wasn't going to last. I had to stay positive. And uh, I think we put it on our shoulders as a team and as a unit to get it done. Our backs were against the wall. We had to win this game. We didn't want to go up there trailing 3-1 in a hostile environment in the United Center. We wanted to be able to try to tie it up and give ourselves an opportunity to win this series. Josh, talk about the over here, talk about the ball movement of the team, and specifically your eight assists as far as how that really plays with the way the offense played tonight? Uh, just um, being unselfish. And, and uh, whenever, we uns whenever we're unselfish during the whole game, it gets contagious. Get contagious and guys were finding each other. Uh, I tried to make a conscious effort when I got the rebound to be able to uh, start the fast break and get easy points for everybody, and, and it worked tonight. Thanks, Josh. You were oh, thanks, guys. <laughs>